This is the Samsung Galaxy S23 FE. If you have this device or you're thinking of picking it up, I have to say it is a really nice device. And one of the beauties with this device is that Samsung have now included all of the AI features that were originally on the S24 Ultra and S24 series have now been included onto this device. Hats off to Samsung for doing that. And what we're going to do is look at one of those features and that is the circle to search. In order to be able to use this feature, it is imperative that you have Android 14, One UI version 6.1. The other thing you'll want to do is go into your settings menu, then select display and then keep scrolling until you get to navigation bar. Select it and then make sure you enable this option that says circle to search. And with that, you're good to go. It's now time to put the theory into practice. So let's start off very simply here. So everyone knows this is the iconic Eiffel Tower, which is in Paris, in France. So let's see how the circle to search feature fares on it. Okay, so what we do now is just press down on the home button and then let's just select one of these images let's select this one here boom look at that that was fast efficient and accurate got it right on point it is the Eiffel Tower okay for my next test what I'm gonna do is take a photo of these wireless earbuds and see how the AI feature is. Okay, so let's go in the camera app, let's move this to one side, let's take a photo, boom, okay, so that's done, and then let's go into the gallery here, and then if we just press down on the home button, and now what I can do is instead of circling, I can just tap, look at how pick it up. Oh, look at that. That is incredible. Again, fast and accurate. So we know that the circle to search feature will work on objects, places, but I want to extend that further and see if it will pick up faces. Not ugly faces like mine, but famous faces. So for example, I've got Tiger Woods, the American golfer who has won numerous majors. As we've done before, press down on the home button, select one of these images so for this one here. See how it fares. Boom, look at that. Accurate and very quick. Now, if you haven't been using this feature, I would highly recommend you do so. One thing to note with the circle to search feature, and that is that it is free to use up until the 31st of December, 2025. Now, up until making and releasing this video, Samsung have not confirmed whether, say from the 1st of January, 2026, whether you will have to pay for this feature, but I'd highly recommend you continue using it for free until then. What may not be commonly known is that the circle to search feature can be applied to the written text. So say for example, somebody sent me this article and I'm reading, I think, oh, OnePlus Open? Oh, it'd be interesting to see what that phone looks like. So again, like we've done previously, press down on the home button and then what I'm going to do is just circle where it says OnePlus Open because obviously I'm definitely intrigued. See that? Now if I just scroll up a bit here and then if I select images, look at that. Now I get pictures of what the OnePlus Open looks like. Throughout this tutorial, you may have noticed that I've used the three button navigation at the bottom of the device. Now, what I want to show you is that the circle to search feature will work without these three button navigations. So, first thing to do is to go into your settings menu, select display, 
and scroll along until we get to the navigation bar. And then instead of buttons, we'll go for swipe gestures. Okay, so you see the three button navigation at the bottom of the device has disappeared. And the beauty with this is that obviously it gives you more real estate on the device. So now if I press down the home button here, and like you, as you can see, it's frosted, so it's ready to rock and roll. And let's just select the area up here. And there you have it. Thank you for watching this bite size tutorial. My name is Sholo, and I'll see you in another episode. Peace.